welcome, 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 welcome to the weekly readings of the Aquarian, Gemini's, or Libra. All right, let's see what is going to be coming up to this weekly readings, ladies and gentlemen. It is from the 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, uh, 13, okay? So, it is from the 7th until the 13th. Let's see what is coming up for you guys. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it is hot. It is hot here. We are having a heat stroke. Okay, it's not so hot in Holland. Last couple of days, years, I should say, it's getting hotter and hotter and hotter. I want to say to each and every person, all you water sign people, please go and hair sign people. Um, Aquarian, Gemini, and Libra, please go listen to the monthly readings, okay? I see the energy of a whole lot of lies is coming out. The worries is going to be over, okay? whole lot of lies and the worries is going to be over, so that is good. And I see um, the Nine of Cups in reverse, whatever is happening and transferring. The energy of the Nine of Cups is in reverse, but your worries is going to be over. So sometimes um, things are happening and it creates a whole lot of issue, a whole lot of problems for you. But this is uh, going to be over. I swear my table is just messed up, but it's okay. Um... Let's just go in there. All right. So I want to say thank you for being here. Go check out your um, Gemini season because uh, um, you guys with a Gemini season is going to be helping you guys a lot. All right. So let's go in it. So let's see what is coming out on Monday. So you have uh, the world in the reverse a situation that is uh, happening is not yet over. Okay. And we see the energy of a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion man. Some of you are dealing with some sort of an issue. And some sort of a communication is going to be coming to this. Uh, they recognize that this person is very deceptive. So whoever this Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion man is, they're going to be recognizing that this person is extremely, extremely deceptive. Okay? Let me see if I can do it without my glasses. I don't have my lens in. They're going to be recognizing that this person have took money on the false pretend, okay? So this is the energy of the Ace of Pentacles. And this energy of the Ace of Pentacles is that money could be returning to some of you, okay? And here we have the Five of Swords. A lot of you were worried. Some of you had some sort of an issue with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion man. And you were worried because it's as if this man has stolen from you. So I see the energy of the lovers. And the energy of the energy of the lovers is about a contract. So it could have been a contract that uh, this man has created some sort of a false contract. And people are now recognizing what is happening. I see um, an excuses is going to be coming in. I see new love. I see help is going to be coming in people are going to be um you know apologizing to you this is a cup of love this is um, news coming in where love is going to be offered and shown to you because they recognize uh, a disturbing situation some of you new love you could be meeting someone on wednesday i see the energy of the four of ones a situation with this man whoever this man is is a pisces cancer a scorpion man this man is now worried he's worried about his business and his stability um this man could be um connected to you as family member but whoever this man is is now worried then we see the energy of uh, um uh, the uh, seven of pentacles and this is about uh, a situation at work for some of you this is about a situation with your business your project if you're self-employed some sort of a contract some sort of a business deal and they're going to be recognizing that a pisces cancer scorpion man was very very shady 
So what we're seeing is that they're recognizing that this man, whoever this man is, it could have been your partner, your ex, and um, there is some sort of an inconsistency and they're going to be finding out, oh, this honest this person is, this, this person has a business and they're going to be finding out how much money this person has took from people on the falls false eye and they're going to be recognizing this they're going to be recognizing that this man has created a lot of contracts on the false eye and um, they're still investigating this man because they recognize some sort of a fraud fall play and fraud and um they are going to be saying to some of you you know we're so sorry for what has happened and they're going to be trying to help you balance out the situation especially if you have a business and this man has created a whole lot of issue for you. I see a whole lot of worries, but worries is not for you, uh, air sign people. It is for a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion man. Then we see some sort of a new start is going to be coming up for a lot of you, and especially people that is having birthday in this week. A new start is going to be coming up for a lot of you, okay? I see they receive a whole lot of information that they were not aware of. It's as if someone has kept this information behind. And as I say, a lot of you are going to be meeting someone new. Someone new is going to be showing you love. Then we see the energy of uh, the Eight of Cups in reverse. So again, a cycle is not yet over. If some of you were having some sort of a problem issue at the workplace, a cycle is not yet over. Then I see some sort of a healing is coming in on Friday. So on Thursday, a lot of you are going to be receiving some sort of a good news, positive news that is going to be coming in. And I see the energy of a balance, the energy of the month comes up on Friday. So um, a lot of you are going to be balancing out the situation and receive a new start. I see the energy of uh, strength is coming up, another 8 energy, 88. Some of you expect uh, um, unexpected money is going to be coming in, okay? Expect some sort of unexpected money that is going to be coming in. So let's look at the weekend. The weekend, we have the energy of the devil very much standing up here. So we are going to be seeing um, what this energy of the devil is bringing in. Then, whoopsie daisy. Then we have the Three of Cups. A lot of you are going to be successfully overcoming a situation. Then we see heartbreaks in reverse. Some of you were dealing with a situation that has to do with a cancer, and this cancer is now heartbroken. They recognize the real deceptive play of this cancer. New love is coming in, an offer of love is coming up. So some of you are going to be meeting someone in the weekend. Some of you are going to be meeting someone new um, on Wednesday, okay? The person on Wednesday, it could be that you are at a business meeting or that sort of a thing. Um, congratulations, you have the Nine of Cups in the upright. So your wishes and dreams are going to be coming true. New love, wishes and dreams are going to be coming true. You're going to be finding out the lies and deceptiveness. Um, some of you of a Libra and some of you of a Cancer. So that was the spread of the week for you guys. And um, the energy at the bottom is the energy of the Seven of Cups. And the Seven of Cups upright is about you healing um, your emotional imbalance. A lot of you was emotionally imbalanced and now you're going to be healing this situation and bringing um, this situation to a balance, okay? So let's um, take a good look at your reading. So what we're recognizing is that you have a lot of major arcana. So Monday, um, Monday, Tuesday, um, when uh, Thursday, Friday, and the weekend, the weekend is the energy of the devil. And some of you be careful of someone you're meeting in the weekend. Okay. This person carry lower energy, lower vibrational energy. So be aware of this. So, but I see a lot of you are going to be feeling happy and successful. A new love is definitely going to be coming in. Some of you are going to be meeting someone and you're going to be feeling very happy and close to this person. The heartbreaks that some of you were going through is going to be over. I see that a lot of you are going to be having some sort of a clarity about a relationship that you were in. Okay, a whole lot of clarity 
about some sort of a relationship that some of you were in. Truths is going to be revealed. People are going to be recognizing something about your partner that was not above water, okay? This week, the central energy is uh, having some sort of a new start, turning your back on a relationship, on a marriage for some of you, finding balance and getting over the heartbreak, okay? Because a lot of you are going to be heartbroken, over some sort of a situation that has transpired and you're going to be recognizing the dishonesty of your partners a lot of you are going to be recognizing um that your partners have not been very honest okay there is um some sort of a situation with a relationship where some of you um, when it comes on to work is as awful you were trying to work out on a marriage and a relationship and it is uh, not working and you're going to be letting it go because you're going to be recognizing that I can put everything in the situation but if the other person is not uh, and doesn't want to um, connect with me then um, it doesn't make any sense I pour all my energy in this situation and I see that this is how you're going to be resolving um, some sort of an issue that was happening and transpiring. Then as we look at the base, I see money is going to be returning. I see um, there was some sort of an unconventional situation where there was negative forces that was controlling the situation and was taking a lot of uh, money from you. So it could have been some of you, your partners was uh, lying and creating some sort of an unconventional play and was taking money on the false pretend. And this is going to definitely come out uh, so um, the energy of uh, the uh, Eight of Cups is that a situation is not yet resolved, but it will be. So we see that a lot of you recognize uh, the Seven of Swords, uh, some sort of a deceptive contract that was created. And um, a lot of you, you, uh, you have 77 and 88. 77 and 88 and the situation um that is transpiring is 77 is deceptiveness with a contract where a whole lot of money you have lost a whole lot of money and um they're going to be a lot of you are going to be um trying to get over this and walk away and heal the heartbreak and recognizing the horrible deceptive play that was created and how dishonest a whole lot of people were around you. A lot of you are dealing with the Cancers, the Pisces, the Librans. Um, you Librans are going to be feeling a lot of, uh, and, and recognizing a lot of things that people had played you. So that is coming up, all right? So let's um, look at the Aquarians. Aquarians, you're the ones who are going to be dealing with the Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion man, and it has to do with some sort of a contract. And I see that you're going to be recognizing that this man has created some sort of a false contract. I see um, some sort of a situation with this man is not yet over. I see a lot of you, help is going to be coming in and uh, they're going to be um, like um, this, um, offering their excuses and is going to be re re um, resolving a situation because they recognize. I see this man is very worried, a Pisces Cancer, a Scorpion man is very worried and this man um, is worried but um, you know you guys are okay because you you guys are standing up against this man for something that this man have done and created and you guys are really standing up against this man then um, when we look at uh, uh, the the Gemini's the Gemini's you are um, you are receiving information that you were not aware of. So I see that um, you Geminis are going to be turning your back on your marriage or relationship or some sort of a contract with a work or um, a house contract or it's that you're going to be balancing out your emotional uh, situation, Geminis, because you recognize that there was some sort of a fall play, Okay. Help is going to be coming in because I see um, someone is going to be helping you to balance out of a situation where it has to do with financial. So I see 
um, this energy of the seven of pentacles, it could be a situation at a um, home. It could be some sort of a situation you're having to deal with, with your marriage. But I see love is going to be offered to you, Geminis. And I see the energy of the star that some sort of a healing is going to be coming in. Now, Geminis, you're affected very heavily because we have the energy of the star we have the energy of temperance and we have the energy of you trying to endure a situation okay you're going to a situation and you're trying to endure the situation so gemini um you are going to be affected um heavily on friday finding out some sort of a situation and trying to um go through the situation and resolve some sort of an issue Okay, so Gemini, be aware of this. Uh, Librans, what we see is that you Librans recognize uh, that there was some sort of a negative forces that has created some sort of an issue. I see the energy of uh, um, the Nine of Cups that some of you Librans, uh, you're going to be overcoming this, okay? Um, the Nine of Cups is about you and your lover and uh, relationship-wise is going to be good. But um, outside of relationship, like... Uh, um, there is going to be some serious problem that you uh, Librans have to deal with. And I see you Librans are trying to resolve some sort of a problem with a new love or some sort of a problem. Uh, some of you could recognize that you're pregnant and that was well, not what you were looking for. But I see happiness and joy for you Librans. So um, this week you have the energy of the Three of Cups. So, so Aquarians, you have the Five of Swords where... But it is not you, Aquarians, is a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion man who is worried. Um, and this could be someone who you're in a relationship or you're dealing with in a house or that sort of a thing. Now, when we look at the opposite side, I see some of you, if you had some sort of a relationship problems, it is not over. Some of you could have had some sort of a problem with a new love. It's not yet over. I see that a lot of you are dealing with a Pisces man, whoever the Pisces man is, uh, um, the Pisces man is very worried. There's something that is worrying a Pisces man that some of you are dealing with, and it's because the Pisces man has done something, and it's 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 about to come out. Um, deceptiveness is here for you, you um air sign people, the seven of swords, and uh, it's as if you um air sign people are not aware of some sort of a deceptive play that is going on around you and especially gemini you gotta open up your eyes gemini's there is unseen things that is happening gemini's you gotta open up your eyes because there is some real deceptive play that is happening here and you gemini's got to open up your eyes right okay so let's see so some sort of a situation, it could be your boss, this is a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion man, it could have been your boss, whoever this person is, and whatever is transpiring, you're going to be recognizing and finding out a whole lot of issue, um, a whole lot of situation about a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion person, and this is going to be coming out, and some of you, you know, some of you are going to be very, um, uh, you know, blown off, off the water to find out what this person was keeping behind. A lot of you who were worried, your worries is going to be over. Some sort of a help is going to be coming in for you guys. So a whole lot of you are dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion person. It's something about his financial situation. And it's as if he's not saying this. And I see some of you are dealing with some sort of a bank or a financial institution. And there is just some sort of a deceptive play that is going on. I see... Um, this Pisces Cancer Scorpion person is worried about their contract or worried. Um, it, it could have been that you're married to this person. For some of you, there is some sort of a problems and issue between you and this Pisces Cancer Scorpion person if you're married to them. Then we see um, there was a whole lot of uh, deceptiveness. Some of you are going to be finding out that your partner has been cheating on you. And you're going to be finding this out. So be aware of this, okay? And then we see some sort of an offer of love is coming in. However, this is happening and transpired. There is a whole lot of offer of love that is going to be coming in for you, air sign people. Um, a bank and financial institution, they recognize what the Pisces, um, Cancer, Scorpion men have done. Some sort of a financial institution organization. 
then on Thursday, I see a lot of you um, are going to be deciding to uh, turn your back on this person, whoever this person is and whatever is transpiring. A lot of you air sign people are going to be walking away and turning your back on some sort of a heartbreak so that was created. And um, it's as if some of you received some sort of a news and this news is very emotional for you guys. On Friday, some sort of a resolution is going to be coming up at the workplace. And if you were looking for a job, some sort of a offer is going to be coming in. On Friday, a lot of you are going to be finding out something about a cancer. And uh, um, you, as, you're not really, and Geminis are not aware of what a cancer is doing behind their backs. You got to open your eyes, okay? Friday is a powerful day for a lot of you. Whatever is happening and transpiring, a lot of you on Friday, it is a huge, powerful day. Some sort of a powerful information is going to be um, coming in for you guys. So be aware of that. So um, um, the weekend is, the weekend, some of you have some sort of a new relationship, new partnership. It is crazy because this person carries negative energy and is a cancer. If you're in a relationship with a cancer or a Pisces, this person carries negative energy and this is affecting your lives, okay? I see um, heartbreaks. I see endurance. A lot of you are dealing with a relationship with your husband or wife or a, a long-term relationship, someone that you're in a relationship for over 10 years and you're trying to endure this person, whatever is happening and transpiring, whatever you're going through, you're really trying to endure um, this person and the situation that is happening and transpiring. Some really serious, serious situation. And I think as you get to the weekend is where the emotional comes in with a new love, with a cancer, with a Pisces. And the Pisces is as if a cancer, and a, a, if you're in a relationship with a, a cancer, and then Pisces have created a whole lot of deceptiveness um, that is happening. And a whole lot of you are going to be recognizing this in the weekend. So I see a cycle is not yet over for some of you. And a Pisces, Cancer, a Scorpion, man, this man has to pay you back a whole lot of money. I see they recognize that this Cancer man have deceived you and created a whole lot of problems. They have no information um, about what this cancer man have done. For some of you, is a cancer man. Some of you is your husband. And I see a lot of you are going to be turning your back on your partner, whether it's a man or a woman. Then I see some sort of a help is going to be coming up for a project. They have no information and is recognizing um, that um, some sort of a information comes in about a project, some sort of a deceptive situation that was transpiring. The, uh, the Eight of Cups is about Pisces, uh, uh, Mars and Pisces. And this is a, a crazy situation because I see a lot of you are trying to endure some sort of an emotional situation with your your, um, your relationships, your, your partners, your husband, your wife, the lies and the deceptiveness that some of you are finding out about this person. Let's see this Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion man. Yeah, they recognize that this man has stolen a lot of money. Okay, so the Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion man is worried because they recognize that this man has stolen a lot of money and take money on the false pretend. Um, as a lot of you could be dealing with a high professional person, they recognize the deceptiveness of this high professional person and that uh, this high professional person could have collaborated together with a Pisces man to steal a lot of money. And they are now finding out. So both, uh, if, if a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion man is your lawyer, you're going to be recognizing some sort of a deceptiveness of this lawyer. Uh, if uh, um, you have a lawyer, you're going to be re recognizing the deceptiveness of a lawyer. I'm sorry, ladies and gentlemen. It can be a lawyer, a doctor, but it's a high professional person. Could have been your accountant or it could have been an accountant but they're going to be recognizing that these people have created some criminal offense 
you're moving forward because some sort of a government institution organization have now recognized some sort of a fraud that was created and it has to do with a Pisces cancer or scorpion man I see some sort of an apology it could be a situation at the workplace some sort of an apology is going to be coming up some of you this could be a bank financial institution or a government institution that recognize uh, that there was a crime that was taken and a pisces cancer scorpion man has uh, done this uh, because i see they're investigating his business and they're receiving and seeing information of this man and the deceptive play of this man then i see some of you are going to be reconciliating or someone wants to return to your life but uh, Whoever this person is, is as if some of you are going to be recognizing that um, this person wants to work on the marriage or the relationship or the friendship. But I see some of you are not going to be doing that because you recognize how deceptive this person was and how this person has created a whole lot of deceptiveness in your world. OK, so someone wants to return. Someone wants to work out a relationship but I see there is no, you're not open to this because you recognize I cannot give this person another chance after what they have done to me. Then when we look at the star and the devil and you're trying to balance out some sort of an emotional situation, you are going to be very successful, okay? And you're going to be successfully overcoming a cancer person that use negative forces to control a lot of you. And this cancer person is from another country, another city, or another country. This person was not born in the same country as you. And this person used negative forces to control a lot of you, and it's a cancer. And they're going to be recognizing how really deceptive this cancer is. And a government institution is going to be recognizing that this cancer had lied and cheated and got in to some country on the false pretend and they're now investigating this cancer um, information because they recognize that this cancer have lied and they recognize false documentation of this cancer and they're investigating and I see a lot of you are going to be finding out and recognize the undesirable play of this cancer and you're going to be successful you're going to be getting out of it and be very successful then when we look, I see you're balancing out a situation because you find out that this person, this cancer from another country, another city, some of you is a cancer, some of you is an Aries, some of you is an Aquarian, some of you is a Virgo. So the negative energy um, is affecting you and it can be a cancer, for most of you is a cancer. Then we see and um, you Aquarian, it could be dealing with, um, trying to resolve it for the rest of your sign. Fortune is going to be returning because they're going to be recognizing um, that some of you, your partner has uh, really was really a gold digger. And a lot of you are going to be regaining fortune and you're going to be successfully overcoming. So what we see here is that you're trying to balance out a situation because they recognize uh, that an Aries... Uh, and a Virgo and a Cancer has created some sort of a criminal offense. And now they saw how much money these people um, have took from some of you. And now um, they are going to be trying to balance out the situation. So I see a lot of you are dealing with um, some sort of a high professional person. And it could be some sort of a divorce also that is coming um and you decide to walk away um, from this person, but this person is trying to come back and is working, but working back in order to get you back. But it's it's a no, don't do it, don't do it. A lot of you is now in thoughts. A lot of you are now in thoughts. A lot of you were in um, some sort of a new relationship. Is in thoughts whether or not you should move forward. Um, you feel good in this relationship, but you you have questions, okay? And it's uh, there's nothing wrong in um feeling good in a relationship, but having questions, okay? Your enemy, a lot of you are going to be finding out that your enemy is a Pisces and uh, a Gemini, okay? So Gemini's, you could be finding out that your enemy is a Pisces. Um, Pisces, you could be finding out that your your enemy is a Gemini, okay? 
so um a lot of you have uh, enemies and the enemies is by the pisces and uh, they're going to be finding out that a pisces man had lied i see they're going to be recognizing the truth about a pisces man the pisces man could be someone who was uh, born in another country lied about where he was born that sort of a thing i see that they're coming down on a pisces man because they're recognizing that a pisces man has created a huge step and it's as if a government cooperation institution is recognizing this so, so i see if some of you are dealing with a high professional person an accountant uh, someone who does your taxes and that sort of a thing they're going to be recognizing like the tax company is going to be recognizing that the person who uh, collaborated with a pisces cancer or a scorpion person to do their tax or um they had cheated a whole lot of money and i see that people are going to be finding this out a whole lot of you i see you someone is returning an ex but you don't want this person you you definitely do not want this person and you need to just tell this person that you are not open for any relationship with them it's good to just let this person know so that they can move on um some of you is as if you're in a relationship with a pisces but you're kind of um wondering it's as if this person is playing devil's advocate okay devil's advocate friday and saturday some of you could be regaining fortune friday and saturday um i see that a virgo for some of you and a pisces wants to recollaborate or reconnect with you whatever the spices is is in another country or if it's from another country but i see no contact with this person this person is not very nice this person has stolen a lot of money from you and um, some of you this 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 person is not honest maybe it's your husband and you're going to be finding this out let it go this person is just not honest okay so be aware at the workplace or with friends or people of an aries and a virgo and a cancer these people are born in another country another city and they are very deceptive because a government institution is now recognizing um that these people are now um you know very deceptive you gotta stay clear of them i do love you guys please like and share these readings and i'm saying namaste until next time